Those small spots of red, yellow and green colour on beaches are not corals or shells or scales from marvellous fish. They are pre-production plastics called plastic pellets or nurdles. They can be found everywhere, which is to be expected. Up to 160,000 tonnes of nurdles are spilled every year in Europe. Almost all of our everyday objects are made using this raw material, from your salad bowl to the bumper of your car. These plastic pellets, which can also be in the form of flakes or powder, with highly varied colours and compositions, have major impacts on the environment given their very small size, under 5 millimetres. They are released at every stage along the plastic supply chain, during the manufacturing, transformation, distribution and recycling, due to poor industrial practices, lax handling or transport accidents. In May 2021, a container ship that had caught fire spilt tons of these microplastics onto Sri Lankan beaches, a veritable plastic spill. Europe is no exception and suffers chronic plastic pellet pollution, whether it be from transport accidents or regular leaks from factories. Nurdles inevitably end up polluting natural environments. These plastic pellets, which are very light, are carried by wind and rain, circulate in water networks, rivers, the ocean, where they release harmful chemical pollutants and end up on the beaches or in the stomachs of hundreds of species, and from there, in our dinner plates. Surfrider Foundation Europe calls on European institutions to adopt regulatory measures to prevent spills and stop plastic pellet pollution by obliging companies in the supply chain to take action and by making them responsible in the case of leakage into the environment. It's urgent to put a stop to this.